let's check out some data manipulation tools in Patch. Let's go ahead and recall snapshot one, just so we're all in the same place. You can do this by typing in snapshot one on the command line, pressing enter. Let's go ahead and go into patch. So I'm going to double tap my address patch button. And we are going to look at how to copy channels and move channels. So the syntax here is the same as it is for our record targets. So I'm going to say 101. You should have channel on your command line. If not, go ahead and press your format button. So we're in patch by channel. Copy to 106, enter. You'll notice this copied the fixture type, our solo frame theater there, has now populated into channel 106. The address was not copied as we'll need to assign the new address to this fixture manually. If I'm adding another fixture into a show, perhaps I've queued it some already, and I'm adding an additional fixture into the rig that's going to be included in many of the same places, I could use the syntax 101, copy to 107, and then hit my plus show soft key, enter. In addition to copying it in patch, throughout the show file, all the places where channel 101 was previously, channel 107 is now in those places as well. So any queue, palette, or preset that contained channel 101, with this simple keystroke, I've now put channel 107 into all of those locations as well. I can also do this only with the show information. So I could say 101, copy to 108, only show, enter. So in patch, it looks like nothing happened, but what happened in our show file is the same thing with 107. 108 is now stored into all the targets that 101 was in originally in our show file. Let's take a look at that. So if we go into blind and we'll wanna be in spreadsheet, mode if you're not already, go ahead and hit your format button to get there. And if we look at channels 101, I'm gonna go ahead and press shift format to hide our non-intensity information. So we can see what we're looking at a little more clearly. So now you can see down in Q18 that channels 107 and 108 are now mimicking 101. This is also going to be true in all of our palettes, presets and other record targets as well. Going back into patch, our final option we have when copying channels is 101, copy to 109, only text, enter. And rather than putting that into targets like the previous soft keys did, this is only going to copy our database information. And we will look at that in our next video. I can also move a channel and patch, which is essentially just renumbering that channel. So if I say 106, copy to, copy to, so I get move to on my command line. I'll say 110, enter. I've effectively renumbered 106 to be 110 everywhere in my show file. So in every queue, in every other record target, what was formerly 106 is now going to be 110. It is worth noting that there are a couple places in the desk where information is not copied or moved in this manner, and those are macros, magic sheets, and pixel maps. So be careful about moving content around if you are calling out those specific channels in any of those places. Let's look at some more of this content. So if we go into blind and say focus palette one, and I'm going to be in table view here, we can see that channel 107 is mimicking channel 101 in this focus palette because we use the plus show modifier when we copied that channel in patch. If we go into our group list, so we have a few groups here that were affected. So you'll notice group five and groups 23 have channels 107 and 108 in there now. And we actually don't want those in there. So we're going to say group five plus group 23. And these were also put into group 99. So I'll say plus group 99, enter. So select all three. And then from here, I can say minus 107 through 108, enter to remove those from all three groups. This will assist in our programming later on.